Parody is out here, and starting over is the worst feeling in Mind Over Magic, but it's the best feeling. Let's go. Relentless, Darkness, Random, Iron Mage. Yeah, I had a terrible wipe last episode, uh, right at the end. And you go check out the previous episode, and you can see how things were going really, really good. And then I took one too many fights. I tried a two-skull battle in the underschool and had had uh, two of those water AOE mobs, and it was just too much for me to handle. And I got wiped, and I don't think, uh, I, don't think uh, I should be taking those two skull battles as early as I did, uh, so lesson learned. And we're gonna start over again. We will select, uh, of course, air mages. We're doing that for sure. And I'm gonna sit here and reroll till I get two that I like. We have our starting mages, uh, exactly the same as my last, uh, uh, God comp, where I went with the, um, they both have boosted power, but I uh, went with the research 1.5x faster. And then for this one, when I was re rolling, I just kept re rolling until I was either going to get teaches faster or 2525. And I'm happy to see the 2525. So this took me um, about 10 minutes total to roll these up. One thing I had to say, and um, I hope the developers consider this is reroll systems for starting characters like in oxygen not included and, and i think rimworld maybe has it like that too i'm not sure but oxygen not included has it like that these reroll systems they suck okay because people are going to min max if they want to like i'm going to min max for sure um when i'm playing the hardest settings and all it means is i have to sit here for 10 minutes rolling and staring at the numbers and checking and stuff it's really annoying um this re random reroll is is dumb um it's not fun and we're still gonna do it what you should do is literally let us just choose have a points allocation system Maybe these things, you know, like boosted power is really, really powerful. And obviously boosted speed and power is really, really powerful. If I was the devs, I would not let these two be combined. I would not allow these two to be chosen or ever come up. It's his, it's his overkill. When you can get this on a, on a mage with Wolfkin, um, I think it's really overpowered. And actually when I was rolling, I went for like 10 minutes trying to get uh, this one to set up and I just kept on checking 2020s for uh, for the classroom speed I was starting to think that maybe they had already patched this out so you couldn't get this but then it did come up so I am going to go with it um, but yeah my suggestion would be at a bare minimum let's choose our race okay they'll just reduce the re-rolling like I'm going to play Wolfkin you guys have made Wolfkin overpowered um, and the reason they're overpowered is they get uh, you look here um they can they get high speed and sleep anywhere right so they don't suffer penalties they sleep outside or on the floor they prefer to eat diuret or croa over meals so they're perfect for the hard setting because then your gut bear can be used for pushes as they're at least you got two guys who are automatically going to start eating dire rats and they get no conviction against it so they're superior in that way but then they have a default of 20 speed right so that that's insane that that allows them to act before mobs and then they have a default of plus 10 power are you kidding me so wolf can start with 20 speed and 10 power and they eat dire rats and get no conviction and they can sleep outside on the floor like the perfect starting characters so i really think wolf can are, are op um obviously we, in the last episode when i got the bane of the wolf can it kind of shut down my plans but th that's pretty rng uh, as well so anyways let's go enough talking Okay, here we are. Standard start. Go in and repel. Same old, same old. Hit that speed up. Let's go. And boom. It is opened up. And we are just going to simply um, do the standard where we just go and say uh, chop. Just get it all set up initially. Harvest. Um, maybe a couple of stone you know three stones um and a couple of rats this is gonna select um and select maybe two of them no i think three of them yeah and i set that all to three and i'm gonna micro and so we can let that go 
And they're gonna mine for probably four hour or harvest stuff for like four hours. And the gut berries where it needs to be. Okay, there's the wood coming in. I don't mind the extra gut berry, honestly. Okay, so now we gotta start focusing them. Put a five on this. A five on this. Okay, so I got the wood I need, so let's start focusing now on stone. Five on that. Let's put the hunts up to five. Okay. That should be almost enough there. Let's uh, let that go. Okay, let's try that. Um, so first things first, crafting, wand shaper. Got that in place, and then we will want to uh, let this occur before we do too much more. Five of this. Wand crafting, add wand order. Nope, not air. Add wand or earth. And I'll just do, just do until one. Priority five. Should get him going faster than that. Wait on that, we'll change the schedule around. Process like this. Okay. One's done. Summon. Okay, that one's done. What do we get? We got a, a girl, so that's um, furniture. Build her cot. Okay. Cot's done. Gonna go in here. Um, properties. So the way I'm going to do this, actually, there's a good comment. I don't want to look into uh, how to do specialized rules and stuff um, necessarily. While I'm, uh, like I know that there's this, so there's this. Maybe we'll look. There's these groups, right? So if I add custom group, I'm going to call this uh, dude and being students' beds. Okay students beds and then i'm going to add a rule um and it's going to be membership is a member of students okay oh that's cool how it shows you it's a member of students students beds is a member of students Add rule um, is faction is is not Wolfkin. 
And then, okay, so that's how that works. So basically, this rule now is saying, if the student is a, if it's a student, and in fact, it's not Wolfkin. The rule, you know what? I don't even need this. If the faction is not Wolfkin, so let's just call this non wolf beds. Okay, so basically now what'll happen is I'll add that rule to all my beds and the wolves will, will not sleep on them for the first bit. That's pretty cool. I'm glad that I'm starting to learn about this. I think that'll open up a lot of power. Um, now, how do we assign that non wolf beds? Ah, uh, okay, cool. That works really well. <clears throat> okay, anyways, back to this. Uh, wand is almost done. Still got time. I'm gonna try and pump two students in the same day. Whoa, I got to... Why is this guy idle? Did they really already cl clear everything? Oh, that's crazy working fast today so let's just get the stone we'll just say a three on that in mine and we can start taking this stuff down actually i'm going to do like this it's a better practice to do like this there and just have a look um no sun shadows trees very mines wormwood let's get some wormwood going on as well okay Actually, you know what? We'll get some ice petals queued up as well. Okay. So we got the next student that we can bring in. Let's begin. <clears throat> Give me a second here. I believe it's all working okay. Yeah. Okay, so um just had to check something in my my recording software. I would hate to be doing an episode and uh not record it. So okay, so we're we're going along. We got the two students. What kind of student we get? We got this kind, so we better get that bed going real fast. Let's put this one here. So that's done. Five. Um, we need that to get done fast. Okay, and then we just simply go here. We can just go copy. Well, I can build copy with settings, so that's even better. Um, this is build copy. Build copy of settings. There's no oh copy settings here. Yeah. And you can go here, paste settings, and I should be able to look and see an access that yeah, it's set up to non-wolf beds. This one, same thing. Okay. Um now we need to get the fog push going. Uh oh, what's what are we missing here? Wood. Oh, because I spent on the bed. Jesus. That's not good. May have screwed this up. Come on, guys, go fast. He's going for it. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I should have done the push first before building that bed. Might have pushed too hard today. Thought I could do it. See, this could be a wipe. Then I'd have time. That was a mistake. That was a huge mistake. I'll deal with it, but you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that because what's going to happen now is um, anything that's on the ground here is going to get wiped, which is like a lot of gut berry and stuff because it's going to move in so close because I'm not going to get that off in time. They need an hour to do it, and I didn't get it started fast enough because I built that bed. And maybe I didn't even have enough wood because I built an extra wand. So maybe going for the second student on day one is actually not possible. I thought I could do it. Yeah, watch this. It's going to wipe all, all the stuff that's on the ground out. 
Here it goes. I'll still deal with it. Okay, so came close. It definitely wiped some stuff out. Um, I'll deal with it. I'm not. Uh, I'm not going to start over and have to sit there and reroll for ten minutes just to uh, uh, do all that all over again. That is not what to do. Do your fog push before. Do it earlier. Now, hopefully, I didn't lose that much stuff. <clears throat> Lost a little bit of gut berry, though. I know that. But I'll deal. Okay, next thing is, too, is we need to um, build the... Uh, have a look at the uh, teaching stone. And it's going to need wood, of course. So let's get some priority on some wood. We get that built turned to night by our ghost, hopefully. Another alternative to what I knew that I wasn't going to make in time rather than sit there doing the fog push would have been to told everybody to start moving the gut berry over uh, out of the way just to have salvaged it because it's the only thing that matters really. The rest of the stuff was all used up that was important and or was sitting out here. So we got to definitely need more gut berries so we're going to tell him to harvest at speed five on that stuff. Yeah. And then um, the other thing, though, is we need to go and get this learning stone built. And um, we're probably just going to do it like we did the other day, which is uh, just have it here, but jam it in. Will I jam it in? Maybe not. Maybe we'll just do it like this. Space it out nicely. I think I'll set up one back. Yeah. We'll do it like that. Okay, um, because we want the, the uh, students to um, start learning immediately the next day. And hopefully he's going to go for that. It's more priority than this, I believe. Yeah. I'll load it up. It'll take him a while. But they have to get up and they have to eat. I think I'll have it done in time. And then in priorities here, we're going to change where um, this guy is our researcher and he will uh, not teach. And then this guy is our teacher, and he will not research. And the ghost will never research, and the ghost will never teach. And the ghost will be told to haul with priority. Okay. <clears throat> We're also going to do the priority here for the researcher. We're going to actually tell it for a while to uh, assemble with priority. And then we need to get uh, chop on these five. Some wooden. Next is... Um, also, the research has to start right away, so crafting. We will need a stone and wood, of course we do. Um, so we'll need a little bit of stone. Probably going to need this to be a five, and this to be a five. And we definitely need as much wood as possible. All right.
Now it's just stone, so we're going to select everything. Okay, and we're going to tell the uh, these to go back to three. Um, I wish you could go back. They need a back button so I can work that menu like multiple times. I mean, it's great for selecting stuff, but anyways, that'll uh, hopefully trigger to go back to the stone here. Is that enough? Nope. This one we'll just put over here. Yeah, maybe we'll put it here, actually. Oh, no, he's close. To the, he's close to the mana. Okay. Let's get researching right away. You know it. Chess. Now we carefully check where we're at. What do we have enough for a push? Uh, gut berry, we have enough for a push. I wouldn't mind getting a little bit more gut berry. There's a bunch out here I want to work on. I wish it would show me what the ingredients are. I guess, can I look here and see? No. Oh, here it is. Wooden stone. I think we have enough. So let's, uh, let's get another, uh, oh, it has one. Oh, my bad. Yeah, so, but if we summon a student, then they're going to make one. So, um, hold on. So who's the researcher? Anborg. So, summon student, um, and work here yeah. again. Need another cot. Searcher to go hit this tree down immediately. I just did it again. Who's our researcher? This guy. Um, you need to go back to baseline on this and chop priority. Now oh, the ghost went to do it. Is that gonna be enough wood? Oh, he's so slow at it. I want this guy to do it. Get another one going. Come on, hurry up. I'm gonna miss again. Unbelievable how badly I'm screwing this up today. Yep. Don't know how much stuff that'll destroy, but it's going to destroy some of it. Anything that's laying out here, like all this gut berry, is getting whacked. 
Unbelievable. This is the worst I've ever played. I almost want to start over. And never show anybody this bad play. But I'm going to keep pushing on. Don't know if I have enough gut berry available now. I have no idea if I'm going to have enough gut berry to, uh, to go on. Do I get a free day? Yeah. Okay. That's not that bad. Yeah, I'm going to keep going. It'd be interesting to see how devastating it is to fuck, uh, sorry, uh, to screw up the fog um, two days in a row. Like the first two days, I can't believe that I back, I didn't do the fog correctly. So what you're supposed to do is push the fog before it comes in so it doesn't destroy all the stuff on the ground. Research-wise, he's already done that. So, um, basic rituals, research, and build chests, storage, uh, smoke stick. How have we not harvested any smoke stick? Why is there none close? Why is it all so far? There was a pat, a small patch today to this, so they may have uh, changed some things around. For all I know. Okay, so at least we can get some chests going. Um, with this thing here, it kind of changes things for chest placement. Um, so I think we will just, let me see if this is here, maybe we'll just go like this. Yeah. And then put it in front when we have enough. Getting one going is going to help. On day three, you can, you don't have to push the fog. So you get a break. And that's the only reason I didn't quit. Because if I if I didn't if I had to push it again today, I don't think I'd be able to get the gut berries. But I just have barely enough to kind of keep things going. And how are we doing on learning? Why have these guys spent an entire day learning and there's only one of three? Probably because it's just, it's a normal classroom. I understand why the bar is not moving. There it is. Oh, it's because they learned the other. Maybe they learned their other skills on the first day. Okay, so, um, but one thing we have to do is one, two, three, nope, not enough stone. Okay, uh, won't do that yet. We'll let this go. So, I'm going to need some stone. The stone. Already set priority five across all the gut berry. Wood wise, we are short. So. Leave my researcher at priority five on that for now. Really important if I need wood. I can just drop it when I want to adjust it. Okay, there we go. I think I'll use this for some fast stone. It'd be an easy way to get some resources. Those chest up in just in time.
<laughs> so he's gonna do zero. Oh, you can just do nothing. There's some, there's a nice one. Oh my God, look at all that viscera. Wow. Wow. I almost feel like I should take this fight. I think I will. I'm going to push it. This is always the bane of my existence. I push fights when I have no business doing such a thing. But I honestly don't care that much. I'm taking a chance. Now this is not going to go well. Um... I'm going to actually deviate from my plan and I'm going to shield the wind. Otherwise, someone's going to die. Shield the wind to take the first blows because they have, before they get their armor up. Okay, now he can, he can armor up. Good. And he can armor up. Now we can get down to killing them. That's what I should have done in the last fight. Gotta remember that trick. And then uh, keep armoring up, guys. Yeah, just armor up. Stack your armor. Oh my god. Good thing it's vivified. <laughs> Take some blows. <laughs> Uh, it's hilarious. I take some risks sometimes. Give yourself a bit. Well, that was strange the way she died. I don't think I ever saw that. Did they changed that. Oh my god, I thought he was going to die. No, I guess he wouldn't. He's got still 100 hit points. Certainly having vivified students at the beginning is a good way to get around the, uh, the thing. Of course, get the Wolfkins online as fast as possible for your tanks. All right, that was a good haul. That's that's those resources are going to really come in handy. Um, the stone plus the viscera is just going to come in so huge. There's more viscera. So let's see if we can't get this going fast. Uh, I'm gonna go four, four. Priority. Then we're going to go into these priorities and our researcher. Um, we're going to go back to this to be normal, but we're going to say construct is high. Okay, we're going to put the ghosts high construct for now too. Don't need to do a fog push today, right? I could, but I don't need to. Okay, let's get 
some lighting going on. Right too. Should be enough, yep. Oh yeah, the other thing too, somebody mentioned a comment which was brilliant. Um, turn off seeds on chess. You need to do a pish tomorrow. Gut berry is low and they're gonna eat as well. I think I have most of the gut berries set though to five. We'll just double check it all. Finds five harvests, yep. Okay, so now there's the fog. And they're going to do a trick here. Um, I'd like everyone to pay attention. This is what you do. I'm just going to explain it, okay? It's raining right now, and if they sleep, if Wolfkin will sleep outside, if they sleep outside for any reason and get wet, they're going to not be happy because they'll slept while wet. They're going to get like a minus 20 conviction. So when you have this situation and you've been playing the uh, sleep outside bed game, and you, oh, look, at I got a ghost Wolfkin. That's so awesome. Uh, if you have this situation, what you do is you can wait right until this point here. Okay, you wait till it's just past one hour, and then you go and say, fog push. And now they will load it up, and they, they won't go to sleep. They're going to do a fog push, right? So that means both your wolves are down here doing a fog push, and you're going to go into their on their schedule. You see, we're going to drift into their sleep schedule before they're done the fog push. See, they're in sleep schedule. Okay, and then you're going to finish the fog push. And they're going to immediately fall on the ground and sleep, so they won't sleep outside in the rain. Because otherwise, you, if they're outside and hit sleep, they'll just drop and fall. They'll just sleep wherever, and they'll. So if he was out here doing mining right up until the sleep time, he's just going to drop and, and he's just going to sleep right there on the ground and get wet, and then you'll get that uh, conviction hit. So that's a trick to get around it. So we got the classroom, so now the, the learning will be accelerated, and they're going to probably graduate in a day. So we do need to get our research back going on. Uh, basic rituals is almost done. Okay, that's perfect. That's perfect. Good timing. Start checking to see, like, what is our uh, research room going to be looking like for lofted? Starting to get used to it always being like that. I do set select random keywords, but I've been finding lately they don't seem to be random. This seems to always, but maybe it's just not working because this is always lofted. Like literally always. And if I go down and check the medical nurse's office, it's uh, maybe no, because last time it was private, so I guess it is random. So it's lofted as well. That sucks. Anyways, that's for future consideration. The research should finish. We're going to go in here. And now we're going to tell it. Uh, should I go for food first? Or should I go for med beds first? Probably get the food online first. It's a smart move. Okay, so to get the food online first. Um, so that's, set, that's set up. But I can also now look at building this... Um, Ritual Sigil, I need Phoenix Flowers, 10 of them. Uh, I don't think there's any waiting to be scored in this. So Phoenix Flowers is this. Let's set that for now like that. I need more smoke stick as well. We're almost ready to deal with these guys. Now that they've got a classroom, they might learn a bit faster. Mm. 
need one more. Okay. Just stick this one here. Grabbing another student. I need to use both of them. Again. Back. All right, well, we're all building this thing. That's right. Oh, you know what? Another thing I could do. Um, did I get another vivified? Unbelievable. Okay, is this is another. It was corrosive who uh, I believe made the good comments about learning how to use the um, groups and this stuff. So I'm going to make a new group now that I know how. This is going to be called um, uh, Students done okay and then what we're going to do we're going to add a rule where the membership is a member of uh, students okay and that puts all of them in add the rule that um gill capped is not capped now why didn't that work all is not capped the only member is Danny. These guys. Hmm. Danny. There. Okay, so now what that's going to do is, um, and we're going to apply this then, um, access, and we're going to say students done. Yes, so staff, students, so students done. And then staff always, of course. Um, so now when they are um, ready to graduate, they will stop trying to learn and they will actually run around and do other stuff. That is an excellent, excellent thing. And it's going to improve the efficiency so much. Um, I bet this is full. Yep, I'm going to need another chest. Um, Got to be cognitive of my fog pushing. Uh, storage. Gonna get a, another chest right in front of it like this. And add two actually. Go. So that's cool about this whole groups thing and all these rules. Love to see in the comments. Post me some of your favorite uh, group settings that you know of because it's fairly complex. And if they're good ones, I'll start using them. These are the two he mentioned, and I'm using both of them. So I do read the comments, and I appreciate them. See, so Anders now will no longer try to um, to to learn. Instead, in he'll she will run around and uh, and do other stuff if there is other stuff to do, like pick up things. Um, but what we will do, though, is we got to remember is to um, turn off seeds. And then the other thing that he told me was about changing priorities on chests for the fillability. So I think I'm going to do something like that. Uh, actually, I don't quite understand what he meant. Um, it was like do one five, one four, one three, or something like that. But so maybe I'll try it. So we'll put this one to four. We'll put this one to three um we'll uh, also turn off seeds in this one so they'll one stack this then they'll stack this then they'll stack this i would assume so um we'll try that out and see how it works and we have students ready to graduate so um let me see wood wood is important uh, we are going to have to prioritize this one is it a free day i don't think it is let me see Yes, it is. Okay, so that's, I'll still do that, but um, less important. Uh, we can get a graduation going on. Graduate these two injured guys. Again. <clears throat> oh, wait a minute. You know what? No, 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 no. Do I have time for this? Cancel. Yes, I do. Um, before I graduate them, should take a fight. And... 
I think we'll just take this one. The viscera is really nice. Okay. Yeah, before you graduate them, take them in a fight. They're going to get injured, whatever. It doesn't matter. As long as they don't die. Then you can... Uh... Okay, so this could be double AOE on the front. He's going to... Uh, he's going to maybe get to go first, though. Um, they'll live through it. Okay, so let's get the... And it looks like one of my guys, for some reason, was... Uh, no, it was, I was looking at that wrong. So it's gonna, they're going to take a hit, and it doesn't matter, though, because they're going to graduate them. Right? And they're going to live, because they're going to now Earth Armor up. And Earth Armor is 60, so it's just enough. This is well-balanced. That level one tanks can tank that. It's this is well balanced that he does sixty. I think this mob is really well designed now. All right, so boom, the armor absorbs it all, and then we can just start to smash down because we're gonna kill him. As soon as this guy goes. Okay, so that's got that. It's uh, not bad. And now we can graduate them. Both. I get that graduate done. They're just in time for dinner too, so I'd actually save some uh, cup berry. Um, I think these beds I set the access to non wolf beds. I didn't do that one. Non wolf bed. Non wolf bed. Okay. Um, so we need to now summon another student. Human, unfortunately. Looks like I got a, another Earth One ready. I'm gonna do another one. another human furniture caught this All right so we're gonna have one sleeping outside and for or on the ground it's not a big deal students get a buff as a new student, you look in here, right? So they get this um, new student plus twenty. So it's 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 fine for him to do one, like when they first come into if they miss the bed. I might have to use that in the first couple of days and not waste wood on cots and just let them sleep on the floor, knowing that that's going to counteract it for two days. So I think that's going to be a change to how I do things. Is I will not. Uh, because I, I get wood starved uh, early on. And I think if I didn't waste the time on beds, um, they can spend uh, the first day sleep on the ground. The new student buff will counteract it. And that would allow me to then on day one, because I wouldn't do that bed, those beds, I would be able to get the uh, fog push off in time and have enough wood and everything. So I think that refines my plan for the next time I restart. We are need needing some gut berry. Because we're gonna have to do a fog push. And there's gonna be a, a bunch of it get eaten right now. So just go and hunt down my gut berries. So we're able to find them. Might be it. Yeah. 
and we will uh wait for the yeah okay we better uh do another one come on give me a wolf this is ridiculous There we go. So there's our first uh, wolf. I do one more. Have a look at her. Um, that's nice. Not bad. Don't know if it's going to happen. Well, full. It would be nice. This one definitely. So we have to go and make a special rule for her. Um, so add restriction and Gisela meals. Oh, oh, okay. I forgot to do this. Clear all. Wow, I'm really making mistakes. Clear all. So should have had this to be. Fire rats. Got Barry. Actually, that'll. I don't need this. It's a student, so he will eat Gut Barry. Um, okay. Another wolf. Perfect. This one. Nope. That would be very nice, but he's going to get killing blows. So we'll have to remember that Higsby needs some killing blows. Um, and this one that will happen automatically. So just a couple of fairly good tanks coming up. I like that six students. So you're really maximizing this whole thing. And let's just check that I have this to be non-wolf beds. Yep. 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 Checking for my fog push situation. 7 and 32 is not enough. What are we on? Are we on Gut Berry? Okay. So we're going to have to uh, maybe go about to zoom in like about here. Select these uh, and just go chop 5. And then gut berry is an issue. Yep. So I'm just going to select everything and go to gut berry finds and harvest five. So they'll get it as fast as possible. It's going to be an issue. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, research is almost done. That's why I go for the cooking next, because you just gotta you gotta get off gut berry as fast as possible. Okay, Higsby has got one of his things done. Didn't take long. I like placing this right here at the start because of the this is so nice. Okay, so the research is done. Um, and we're gonna let we're gonna back off the research just for uh, a little bit here, because I need to get some uh, some stuff done up top. We got the gut berry now. I need the wood, so we're gonna go in the priorities. And for um, our researcher, we're gonna tell him to chop as a priority for now. <clears throat> Cassie's ready to graduate, so see, he's not wasting time at the Learning Stone. He's running around trying to store goodies. Did get the wooden time. Come on, guys, hurry up. And is that enough? 
believe so. Grab any stupid. I wish it would tell you here what their, uh, oh, you can see it here, but that's dumb. I wish if the star would be here, so you'd know which one had was ready to graduate. It's Cassie. And not that it matters because they're done learning, but just, you know, for principal's sake, if they were in class, I would want to use the one that wasn't. Although the teacher would run down, so I guess it doesn't matter. Just use any of them. Okay, so they'll get this off in time. First one I think I've done so far where I got it off in time. Okay, so that's done. Uh, the next thing we need to worry about then is getting the uh, bit of rice online. Uh, where do I want to have my garden? Uh, maybe we'll do it over here. So I think I'll just uh, tell them to get this going fast. And we'll go into the garden and we're going to get uh, one, two, and then I'll put the third one there. Let's get priority five on these. Hopefully they can get them done tonight. We'll go back into priority and change him back to uh, normal. Okay, I'd really like to get this last one built tonight. I mean, it will because of the ghost. Also set these all to... Okay, next is to build the, um, the grill pot, and I think we'll just stick it here, yeah, so get that prioritized, and we can get food online. Okay, then we'll go in here and we will tell if we're cooking, add meal order, bitter gruel. Uh, we'll do until, we'll just for now do until six, I think. No, we'll do it to five, it's enough for now. Um, they don't have it yet, but, and then we want to make sure that the, um, the priority now is that the um, researcher, the researcher will, uh, Actually, no, I'm, I'm going to make, I'm going to try this. I'm going to make the teacher, when it's got its non-teaching time, is going to try and get the cooking done. So put like that, yeah. Cassie can graduate. We don't need to get rid of her just quite yet. Next is we're going to get our research hall going, get that little bit of a bonus. So we're going to go, um, we're going to go seven high, right, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, seven high, put that, we'll finish that later, and put the cuts in. That. And we will take a battle in the morning to go get some more stone. Fog push is a gut is a wormwood, and we can actually do it. Um, I think we will with that those ingredients just to sort of get it really out of the way for a while. One change I think that got made, I'm not sure, but like these rooms used to give sinew. 
now they give viscera i think it's, it it's like seems like now it's viscera maybe it's just random but i think they might have changed that because viscera is way more important than sinew early game and wait till they eat okay so we look here uh, i need a bunch of stone this looks like the best fight for stone a lava fight yeah so we're going to take this and we will take um our cassie who's ready to graduate and the next highest up one and they're too vivified so they'll be able to tank the hits it for the first round Even with the double hit, he's still fine. So Vivified can work really well. So we're gonna let him tank. So we'll just go ahead and get the uh, the smash laid down. Which really makes it efficient on the um, the skill use. Uh, it's not gonna matter. He'll tank up, but this they're gonna kill him. And that's the. Uh, a very healthy dose of iron and stone is the way you want to do it. Here's a huge whack of stone and iron, so that's very nice as well. Um, so that's going to allow me to finish my building here. There we go. We got that laid out. And then, so this will end up being lofted. I just do like this. Bring that down like that. Confirm. Um, and then we'll just let them build this all. And that's got that done. Um, and then we will have to adjust this later. Because the next will be getting a, uh, very soon getting the, the nurse nursing place going. We'll be trying to get that online pretty fast. But I will build this like this just in case it rains, and then when I want to build the cross, I will just change it and do it again once I get there. But I don't know if I'm gonna how fast I'm gonna get to that. Okay, so that's good. We'll get this light going, and then we have to get back on the researching because we want to start to head towards. Um, uh, this should be four, I believe. We've got to get back to the uh, researching. So, um, and we should bring, we should get Cassie out, graduate Cassie, and we can bring in another one, and now we'll be going with the lightning mage, so we're going to go over here, and we're going to add wand order lightning, and we'll do until X on this, actually we just do one. I only need Y. I don't care what it is. Do one time. Yep. And move this. That should be fine. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> Get the research selected. And we have to go for, uh, we'll go for, like all the way to here now. To double check, um, that'll happen, and that would be nice. Earth mages do construct, so at 
killing blows. So they both need killing blows. Higsby's is more important though. Okay, so one research is done. Now let's just this out of the way. I want to do the big one, so let's just bring in anybody. Uh, that'll buy us a day or two of no fog pushes. start doing battles um this is pretty lucrative i think we'll try it so but now we're bringing our wolves this one okay armor up on all of them actually one will die so one should be able to tank all of it um i'm still gonna armor up on all of them just to try to spread it around and the stack armor on one of them just as good practice um he can't kill him below it so yeah we'll just double armor Okay, so he tanked through that. That was pretty good. And then he took that blow. That worked out well. Okay, so we have a, a smash here we can do and get a killing blow. So we're going to take that opportunity for him. So that's one killing blow on um, Higsby, which is the one I want to focus on. So the dark one is Higsby. I have to remember that. And then this one will just blow out of the water. You can, you can armor up. Take the blow. Uh, you can multi-strike. And he's not going to be able to get the killing blow unless I do a pass around. Um, which I think I will do. Just go for it, right? So, I will smash. And then this will just be a pass. This will be a uh, Earth Arbor. And then this could be a pass. Okay. Oh, he took a bit of damage there. I should have put a shield on him. Forgot he'd still have one taunt up. Um, but he can get the killing blow. So. so I got him two killing blows. Um, might take this one. Should be a fairly easy fight, or maybe this one. Might have AoE though. Um, hmm, I got time. This guy's injured. I'll try anyways. Okay, so, oh my god, oh, this is a serious fight, wow, three of these drowned ones, these things are overtuned, and giving me three of them in a battle is insane, this is insane, whatever, I'll deal, this could be a wipe, if I... You do this. Okay. Um, gonna have you smash. 
You're gonna do this. This is maybe a little funky, but you're gonna have you smash. And you're gonna shield a wind on this guy. Oh, but the problem is though, he only has two taunts. And now the third one's gonna go at this guy. Okay, that's fine. He can he can absorb one blow. Um armor up. Multi. Do you have a taunt up? I bet you do. I bet you do. Let's armor up. This plate's safe. They can tank. They can tank two blows from these guys, so they're less than thirty damage. I think, unless he had so no, he almost he had extra armor up already. Um, regardless, you better you guys better just keep armoring up. So you can take those blows now solo. I don't know. And you're okay. You've got that up, so that's fine. All right, so we got a little bit of a free round here. Where this guy could actually just uh, smash. Not that it does very much, but... Yeah, because it's still going to take... Well, you know what? I will. I will. I'm going to smash. And we'll see how it plays. Okay, so they both absorb. Now he's at 30 and 60, so this guy might take damage. But this guy can taunt and take it all. Yeah. Um, so let's put you up. You're going to tank it all. I'm assuming that you've got... I, I should give a taunt indicator. Um, if you multi-strike, will you get the kill? 84. No, you won't. You'll just get him close. That's good. That's what I want. All right. You can start on this one. Um, this guy is tanking. This guy can go for the kill. Get a killing blow. Go. Yeah, so that was, uh, it does, those bolts are 30, so it, it is uh, fairly good. Um, you're just going to pass for mana. You strike. Another one. Three. Um, you're, this is going to tank it out. You're fine, so you just smash once. Yeah, you tanked it out. Okay. Um, he can get his killing blow. This will be the third killing blow that he needs. So we'll take it. And that's enough for today. So Higby just completed his trial. About where it all is. We will need another uh, research uh, facility done. So let's uh, build that. Secretary. Just put this one here. Another chest. Oh, the good thing is now we've moved the arcane thing. So we can put some chests here. I got a, I got a bit of, I put it a push, so I got a little bit of a free time. So we'll, uh, we'll get that going. Then we don't have to work, worry about storage for a little bit. In the morning, I need to summon the lightning mage. Get 
one more to graduate soon. They're all getting come up, come up pretty good. So maybe one more day. How's we doing on these? So it's still a while to go on that though. Higsby, you're almost done, right? Don't care about that. So he's ready to go. Um, yeah, unfortunately, we are a little lacking on the food department. Oh, there's a reason for that. Students, bitter gruel, off gut berry, but then add restriction. Um, it'll be, I'll just do this for now. Uh, Gisela. No, you know what? I can do this, right? I can do this. Groups. Add custom group. Wolf. Dude and... Dude. And then for Wolf Students Food, the first rule is, is their membership is, um, is a member of, no, uh, no, 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 is, uh, should remove, it's a faction. Faction is Wolfkin. That works. That works, I believe. Faction is Wolfkin. That's all I need. And then um, I can go into then consume, and I can say Wolf Students Food Meals Clear All Dire Rat. Then meals for these guys can now be changed to bitter gruel because it will apply to humans, I believe. I think that this will work. Not sure which one, how does this have priority? Like, this is all staff. Would that not then allow all staff to have meals? Not sure how this works. Um, so, If I, if I turn this off and then what I do is I actually go into groups and I make another custom group, um, normal food. Okay. And add rule where a uh, faction is not Wolfkin. Yep. So faction is Wolfkin. There's the wolves. Faction is not Wolfkin is the other ones. Normal food, wolf, student food. Okay, and then I can go into consumables. I can literally just say, this is all off. This is all, just clear all, clear all. Add restriction, uh, normal food, meals, uh, clear all. And go in and say, uh, where is it, uh, bitter gruel. So that should, if I'm thinking correctly now, force these for dire rats these for normal food. The only other restriction is um, Gisela. Gisela, meal, clear all. And it has to be gut berry for the achievement, uh, for the medallion. And I think that that'll work. We're gonna find out. Now, what else do we need to do? Okay, so we are starting to research to medical beds, so we're going to want a nursery set up as fast as possible. So we have to actually move this over like this. I'm going to do that. Okay.
Come on, guys, move this thing. You have to click both priority five. I guess it can be used right now before they shrink it. No. Not that important to do it right this moment, though. Gisela. Um, Eight gut berries is not uh, making her happy, but now she's getting the boredom thing, so that conviction is going to become a problem because of the in pain um, part. Mm, I really want to get this medallion done, though. It's going to take a while, too. And this one as well. So, um, we're going to have to... Higsby is going to be doing the same thing. So we need to get med beds online. Okay, so we just get them anywhere for now. Just to have it, get it going on. Um, what if I do like this? Can I do one here? And one there eventually? I think so. Even one is going to help. Prioritize this, please. Okay, good. No research, so he'll get busy. Okay, so um, we'll just let them bounce. I'll put this on a priority four. Five. Um, now we have to go into these priorities. We have to say for Gisela, XB, you want to do that. And these guys should always also have that. And then aid. Uh, for now, I think that the one who will always want to focus on aid will be the researcher. I never want the teaching to slow down, so try that. Get them healed up, it'll be fine. We can also graduate these guys. So we can start taking uh, more people. And we just want any lightning mage so we can start getting gifted students. Okay, so let's hire a lightning mage. Still haven't made that wand. What's going on with you guys? Thought I told you to make one. What are we missing? We're missing uh, Stinu. That's easy enough to get. Two. Gonna need three. Do it. Oh, and board for now to uh, hunt. Do we need to do a push today? Nope. Okay, so as soon as they're healed, we'll be fine. He's making it now. We're going to need to do um, some adjustments here. Start doing that now. Um, it's not going to rain, so it won't be a problem. Construction. We need a wall here. It's going to go up to quite a distance, actually. And then we're going to need a wall here. It's going to go up at least uh, 
be eight high. So this one can now be adjusted. So that's even. It's going to be like that. And we're going to need the stairs here. And they're going to go up to, I believe, there. And there's going to be a floor. It's going to end up going across. Because that's where that floor will go. So yeah, so like this. Like that. that first I'm going to um priorities and we're going to turn off we're going to set teaching down here because there's no one to teach um cooking's fine there construct up he's got construct up so that'll work so they'll get really busy on this I need to fix this quickly so we're not doing any research and we're not doing any teaching right now so it works Concern would be about the wood. Any wood down here in any battles? I don't think so. Anyhow, I just uh, I looked at the time on this video, and I'm already. Uh, hour and a half which is longer than I normally would go I usually like to keep them to an hour um, so good start um, just quickly so I don't forget the next day throw about four lights in there hit the like button subscribe leave me comments would love to hear feedback I think this one is going okay it got off the rough start with mistakes I was making but overall Pretty happy with the fact that there's rain coming right now. Are you kidding me? Well, we'll deal with that next episode. Basically, I have to quickly uh, fix these roofs and get a roof on here and try and prevent the damage. Maybe I'll just quickly do that. I was going to just sign off, but uh, honestly, um, I don't want to start the game up and sort of forget that's going on. So I need those to go real fast. Here's how you deal with this rain garbage. I need these things to go as fast as possible. And I need to get a uh, roof on this thing as quickly as possible. Firm. Get some priority going. So let's uh, see about that. Gonna just play for like five more minutes, I think, and get this kind of finished. Because otherwise, I'll I'll start the next episode and I'll forget what I was doing, and all of a sudden the rain is gonna hit and start damaging everything. So, okay, so this one can be done. Uh, so the roof can go like that, and that'll work. And we're waiting on this one still. That's five. This one's done. So for now, the roof can just go like this, and that's fine. And task five, okay. Wasn't quite what I was planning on doing, but for now, at least it's phase, phase one. Save us from the rain. There we go. 
So that's a little bit better uh, to leave it off on so we don't uh, come back to problems to deal with right away. Let's get this going. It's looking lovely. So more or less a little bit behind uh, where I'd like to normally be because it took a while to get our wolves. They came very late. Um, and we just could see that we just got that built in time to stop the rain from doing a bunch of damage, which is uh, good. So once this rains over, then I can readjust things uh, to what I want to do here. So I wonder what my conditions are on my uh, bedroom. Skewed. Yeah, we might do that here. I think that's going to actually work out uh, that I can do it here. Um, make it this into skewed and um, maybe get some beds in. Maybe make this a little bit bigger of, a, of an overall room so I can really house everybody. So I actually want to keep playing. It's so ridiculous. Um, but anyways, I'm going to sign off on this episode and uh, wish everybody a great day. Hope you enjoyed the video. Really start to enjoy the game. The devs are doing a great job at balancing this mode. Um, I feel it's almost there. I have to get into the mid game in in it though to really start to tell. We kind of made it there last uh, episode, and I wiped on the first battle. So I do see that like going from like early game to mid game is quite a step. You can't just do it with your starting mages, no matter how, how crazy of a combo you got going on. You need to get into gifted tier two one students to even begin to think about hitting those ones like effectively. So uh, hopefully in the next episode, I'm gonna rush to that. That's my intention now is to just like rush. To to the power team gifted tier two wands two earth mages two air mages and then when they're all ramped up uh then and all wolf can of course once they're all ramped up uh then we can start hitting the uh the skull two battles and see how the balance is on, on like the mid game have a good day see you in the next one peace